Hey traders, thought I'd make a video. I haven't made one in a little while. I apologize. I had to uh, have to have a uh, one of my root canals fell out, and I was talking like Daffy Duck. Um, but uh, just to update things, uh, show you things that aren't always rosy and uh, wonderful. I did have two losing days on um, yesterday. I guess was Wednesday and Tuesday. Uh, again, I didn't update any videos simply because I couldn't talk uh, right, but uh, my tooth looks like it's better. Um, in any event, um, by the way, next life I'm coming back as a dentist. These guys charge a fortune. Uh, in any event, I want to talk about a trade here uh, that I have going on right now. You can see it's working here on the uh, Kiwi. Um, the reason I'm taking this trade is a fundamentally based trade. Uh, for several reasons. Um, the swap rates of the um, benchmark RBNZ's benchmark uh, is falling and uh, it looks like Australia, uh, at least Stevens has come out and said that um, you know they're in no rush right now. As a matter of fact, they've actually taken steps to um, to suggest that um, you know they're they're not going to cut um, and, you know, you're typically talking about a central banker that loves to talk about cutting all the time. And, you know, there's a lot of sentiment in the market right now that they are they're not going to cut. Um, and so I think this is a wonderful opportunity. Now, I know I'm trading the uh, Kiwi US dollar here, but again, um, this trade is more of a combination of fundamentals and technicals. Um, and uh, you can see this level in here, uh, it's coming in here. Um, a lot of people um, don't understand balance areas, but um, this is a big balance area in here. And for those of you that don't know what a balance area is, it's basically a very large disagreement in price. Now, sometimes they go sideways and sometimes they go back and forth like this. And I think this balance area is gonna continue uh, ultimately, uh, I believe that uh, the potential for this trade uh, could be somewhere around this area. But of course, you know, everything changes, right? 65, 76, or 65, 70. Um, again, there's several factors that have to take place. But I'm looking for this disagreement in price or what I call a balance area. Or what's commonly referred to in the market profile community as a balance area. I just look at it differently. Um, to continue here, so I should be okay to somewhere around 69.18 on the trade, um, at which point in time I'll probably take off half of the trade uh, and then just see what happens if we do rotate back down through this. So again, um, uh, simple, fundamental trade, no not putting any thought into it, just using the fundamentals to my advantage and looking at the uh, order flow and saying, you know, what makes sense in this situation. So um, let's see how this trade plays out. Again, um, repeating two losing days yesterday and the day before in the market. It was my first two-day losing streak uh, this entire year. It's, you know, the 4th of the 21st. Uh, it's uh, January, February, March, April, April 21st right now. And uh, my first two losing days back to back. But uh, thank God currency markets are uh, giving me a couple of good trades. So I thought I'd talk about it a little bit more. Hope you enjoy that. And we'll see what happens with this trade as it plays out.